On Money Matters, Disney parks may be closed for the rest of the year. And the number of people applying for unemployment benefits in Florida just continues to grow. It's heartbreaking, Jane. Jane showing us live from her home with us. Oh, three totally. Four. Yeah, good morning. It is absolutely heartbreaking and really not a lot of clear end in sight to this. We don't know when uh, these things are going to be open and back up and running like normal again. Now, Florida was the most impacted state in the nation in terms of jobless claims. All Hub says it saw an 8400 percent increase in claims compared to a year ago. A half million Floridians applied for unemployment benefits last week. Uh, one report says only about 16 percent of those state jobless claims have been paid. Uh, we did see 4.4 million Americans nationwide filing for jobless claims last week. Well, while Duval County hotels continue to be significantly impacted by the pandemic, hotel occupancy actually rose for the first time since the state of emergency was declared, although the increase was just over 1%. Still, it's a gain. Uh, the week of April 12th to the 18th had an occupancy rate of 28.6%. That was up from 27.4% during the previous week. Downtown was about 16% occupied beach hotels slightly better with a little more than 20% occupied. Well, the doors to Magic Kingdom may not reopen till next year due to social distancing measures. Uh, Disney closed Disneyland in California, Disney World in Florida on March 12th. A UBS analyst says it could be January 1st at the earliest before they're able to reopen again. And he says that's because of all the health precautions that Disney will have to take, the social distancing, the travel restrictions, the crowd aversion until there is a COVID-19 vaccine. And Hershey says shoppers are buying fewer snacks and sweets as unemployment soars. Sales of chocolate, syrup, baking chips, and cocoa were up 30% in March. That was families were baking together as we were staying home and looking for things to do. Live from New York, I'm Jane King. Back to you, Bruce and Jen. We're doing a lot of baking in our house, that's for sure. Thank you, Jane. Have a great weekend.